Hey, didn't I tell you to stand up by the wall? No, no. Ah. I want to be near you because I want you to be the last thing that I see if they want to marry. If they do, God knows what will happen then. Good luck, Kim. Kindly tell your sister to shut up. All right, it's your fault. You're the one who scared her. Yeah. I'm feeling much better now. Yeah, well, I'm not taking any more chances. I'm going to give you something to quiet you down. Wait a minute. Tranquilizers? I don't really think that's necessary. She's calm now. I'm fine, as long as someone doesn't blindfold her. Oh, it's amazing how your mood switches up and down. One minute you're losing it, then the next minute you're almost normal. Well, you know, that's how hysteria is. It comes and goes completely unannounced. I'm sure I'm going to have another attack for days, weeks, years. What do you say, Lewis? Tranquilizer. See? It's almost unanimous. Swallow. No, no! I know what my body can take. It's really edgy. This is not necessary. Relax. You'll be okay. It's fast acting. You'll sleep like a baby. No, I won't. Ask Sarah. I have a very bad reaction to pills. I, I, I can't sleep all night. I, I start itching and scratching and... and Swallow it! it. No, and I don't care how much you insist. I am not going to take There's nothing... It's your call, Megan. Take the pill. Or take your medicine. You wouldn't kill me. I'd hate to do it, but we only need one hostage. Two's getting to be kind of a luxury around here, isn't it, Lewis? Amen, brother. Look, she said she'd calm down, all right? There's no reason to make her take the pill. Yeah, until the next time she freaks out, I'm not taking that chance. Take it. Or I'll quiet you permanently. I knew you weren't dumb, wacko, but not dumb. She'll be asleep in a few minutes. And when she wakes up, she'll be a lot sweeter. You probably thank us for it. Thank you. Look, if anything happens to her, I... oh. it's all right. We just need to get down here. Lie down. What do you say, Lewis? It's already a lot quieter around here, huh? Oh yes, much improved, Kip. You guys really get your kicks by this, huh? She said she'd calm down. There was no reason to drug her. Oops. I spoke too soon. This one's acting up, too. Oh, plenty of pills, Kip. Fine. You guys don't scare me right, but if anything happens to her... Shut up! You know, we did her a favor. She acted like that any longer. We would have had to take stronger measures. Yeah. You know, she got off very easy. You know who's done? Yeah, it's all set. I'll give you something to hold on. Nail it in. What do you mean? You're not just going to leave her like this, are you? She'll sleep it off, and when she wakes up, she'll be a lot happier. A lot happier, huh? Oh, yeah, she'll be a nice and gentle person. Take that as a lesson, Sarah. If you just shut up and do as you're told, your sister won't get hurt. Night-night. Night-night. Liar, you don't think I trust you after what you've done! Problem. We are just going to get you up, and we are going to walk this off, all right? You just wake up. Where you going? Oh, not a moment too soon. You didn't take that pill. Well, of course I didn't take it. I couldn't leave you. You need me. Need you? I am furious with you. You scared me half to death. Well, I had to act convincingly. You know, every once in a while, I wish you weren't an actress, a dental hygienist, anything but an actress. Megan, you really scared me. Well, I'm sorry that I scared you. I can't help it if I'm such a brilliant actress. Thank God you're all right. Well, you're the one who got this thing out. Awesome. Good work, Sarah. Yeah, well, thanks. Now, what are we going to do with it? Well, now we've got the pill. And we've got the screwdriver here. Mm -hmm. Two weapons. So? So, before they boarded up that window, I saw that barn, remember? Yeah, so? So, where there's a barn, there's got to be a farmer. A very helpful, trustworthy farmer. Yeah, right. I'm sure there is. But what are we going to do about it? I mean, how are we going to get to him? Well, I haven't figured that one out yet. Screwdriver, pill. Two weapons that are going to help us escape. Now, if we can just figure out how. Just going to move this rug over, and hopefully Kip and Lewis won't notice that we've moved it. Well, they pretty much notice everything else. I don't know. This board is kind of tough. I think we got all the rotten ones up. We could use a crowbar. No, oh, I'll call the hardware store and uh, have them deliver a new one. Oh, well, thank you. Would you? I cannot believe that these people survive without phones. Yeah, well, people live for centuries without phones. Well, with more than that, with without TVs, without electricity. Man. 
No, I just thought of something that we could do with that tranquilizer. What? Well, we could sprinkle it all over either Kip or Lewis's food. They don't exactly eat with us. Well, that's true, but we could invite them. I mean, it wouldn't be too hard to convince them that we had cabin fever, we were lonely, needed some male company. No, that's true. All right, if we could just get a few more of these boards up. Two or three. We could probably fit under this space. Look, we're going to have to make this escape at night. Jackie. Still on the floor, huh? Yeah, well, I'm, I'm feeling a lot better. You didn't eat very much. Well, you know, that's the amazing thing about a nervous stomach. You kind of tend to lose your appetite. Uh, oh, well, maybe I can dig something up for dinner that will impress you. Maybe he can dig something up for dinner that we can sprinkle a little tranquilizer on. I am starting to smell freedom. Me too. I thought this board was going to kill us. I need a breather. Did you hear something? feeling that Jake is on his way to rescue us. Yeah, I hope you're right. Just in case I'm not, let's get going on this escape hole. On to get a glimpse of the future on Doogie Hauser, M.D. Then, following anything but love, a prosecutor's girlfriend is murdered, and he's the only witness on... We now join One Life to Live after these messages. It looks funny. Don't be silly. It's fine. Look, have a bite. Have a bite. No, thank you. I lost my appetite. Lewis, take over. I gotta go to check in with the van. Oh, imagine that. Talking to someone in the outside world. What are you talking to? That is none of your business. Well, now, Lewis, don't let that upset you. You just go, you go right ahead and eat. I'd like my own plate. Well, honey, of course you would. Just a minute. Let me fix that for you. You know I was wrong about you. You were? Yes. That tough exterior. You are so much more fun than Kip. Mm -hmm. I Double. am? Yes, you are. This full beard. There we go. Your own plate. You la, love our la, 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 Well, I guess that our little party is over. Time to clean up. Pinch it. Harder, Sarah! Oh, All right, he's out, he's out, he's out, he's out, he's out, No gun, no gun, no gun. Check for keys. Keys to the van, huh? No keys, no Let's keys. Lock the door. Oh. All right, all right, all right. Let's just go. Go. See anything? Yeah, yeah, there's a light on in the barn. I'm sure there'll be someone there that can help us. All right, Tara, just go. But don't get stuck. Okay, if you're going to go, go now. Lewis is out. 
And the only light that I saw was the one in the barn. Okay. All right, so I just uh, crawl underneath the cottage, run across the field, go to the barn and get some help. Right? Piece of cake. Yeah, sure it is. Okay, here goes nothing. All right. Give me a few minutes and then follow behind okay. me. Okay. Next stop, freedom. Megan, watch out! Oh! Oh! I guess those tranquilizers were a little stronger than I thought. Yeah, but what about the hippie? Was at the band? Where I heard all this I'll noise. check. Do you see him? No, it's all right. It's all right. Go. Coast is clear. No, wait, wait, wait. What? It's Kip. He's getting out of the van. Megan, I was afraid of this. I've got to hurry. No, you go now. You're sure to get caught. It's dark. We've got to take the chance. Just wait a second.